And we turn to Conyers now. Police looking for a man who they say stole a mortuary van with a body inside. Police say the man then led officers on a chase. As Fox 5's Denise Dillon reports, the van was stolen from a crematory. The van belonged to Stan Henderson and Son Mortuary here in Stockbridge. I talked to the owner who seemed just as surprised as the rest of us that anyone would steal a mortuary van. Something you see in the movies, really. Conyers police had been on the lookout for this man, 23-year-old Kijon Griffin. They believed he was involved in a number of entering auto cases. Investigators say when Griffin saw police, he took off running and jumped into a mortuary van that was parked at this crematorium. Police say the van had a body inside. Unfortunately, there was a uh, there was a body on a gurney inside the van at the time. The back. The hatch was was open, um, so when the suspect did take off, the gurney did roll out of the back of the van. So it did end up in the parking lot. Conyers Police they Captain Kim Lucas the says the they went after him, chased him about 20 minutes. When he got on I-20 in DeKalb County, DeKalb PD and State Patrol joined the pursuit. Our suspect did uh, strike a couple of vehicles. Ultimately, he hit a trailer of some sort and blew a tire. Griffin pulled off the road near Wesley Chapel, jumped out and took off running. A number of other agencies searched for Griffin, but he got away. When he's caught, he'll face a number of charges. We are and have secured felony warrants for multiple felony charges for the incident that occurred today. Captain Lucas told me Griffin also has warrants out for his arrest in Gwinnett County. Those also relate to entering auto cases, but stealing a mortuary van may be the most memorable charge. In Stockbridge, Denise Dillon, Fox 5 News.